With LogMeIn Central, you're going to be able to manage, monitor, and maintain all of your computers from one centralized web-based console. So you're going to be able to keep those systems healthy, and you're also going to be able to keep end users productive with LogMeIn Central as well as using LogMeIn Pro 2 for IT management. And you're going to be able to do this uh, without impacting end users and without time consuming office visits. So from the home screen in LogMeIn Central, you can see that I have visibility into all of the machines that I currently have LogMeIn Pro 2 installed on. And I can have an easy direct access to remote control each or every machine as if I was sitting directly in front of it. With LogMeIn Central though, I also get some advanced functionality so I can do things like group these machines in a way that I see fit. So I can create logical groups or structures simply by creating a name and moving computers into those groups so that I can easily sort machines by customers or by clients as you see here. Additionally, I can filter or search across these machines so that I can effectively find uh, computers by specific criteria, whether it's uh, online or offline. I have an easy way to sort and look and sift through machines so that I can find the machine that I'm looking for. But LogMeIn also has a bunch of other functionality that is gonna make my life much easier through the LogMeIn Central console. If I click on the deployment tab, I have an easy way to create installation packages and deploy LogMeIn from anywhere. So I can provide criteria about the specific installation package that I'm looking to create. I can then decide what type of LogMeIn subscription I want to use, whether it's LogMeIn Pro 2 or LogMeIn Free. And I can either even assign a uh, installation package to a specific group. Once the criteria is created, I then have the flexibility of deploying LogMeIn to anywhere via an email installation link or I can create a .msi, a .exe, or a command line, or a batch file so that I can push this out through silent install. So deployment with LogMeIn Central is a breeze. The next area that I think is really valuable for folks to know about is LogMeIn One-to-Many. And One-to-Many is our new automation tool within LogMeIn Central that's gonna give you the ability to execute remote commands, install or update software, run batch files or executable, distribute files, or even update the registry settings. And you can do that from anywhere to machines in a scheduled fashion and manage it in a way that you can execute common mundane IT tasks such as updating or, or pushing out software to multiple machines without having to go out to each individual machine and do it manually. And one to many has full flexibility for you to view progress of tasks in action as well as complete history of those tasks. And if you're an IT provider that has multiple end users that require secondary user access to those machines that you're currently manage, or you have multiple technicians that require access, you have the ability to create secondary users within LogMeIn Central to provide access to those individual computers based off of criteria that you define. So if you create a new user group, you can either grant all per permissions across your entire LogMeIn Central environment, or you can tick off individual permissions on a group of user uh, or per user basis to make it really easy for you to create individual secondary users that have access and privileges only to the criteria or the computers that you see fit. As we get down towards the right hand side of the console, there's full reporting capabilities that give me uh, visibility into user information, computers, management of Pro 2, as well as uh, subscriptions, 
and I can create custom alert packages so that I have the ability or, or a view to create proactive alerts to effectively monitor computers based off of CPU utilization or disk space. There's a whole host of criteria that we can create through alert packages that allow you to look at everything from disk space to file size and folder size, to computer online or offline status, all the way down to hardware inventory, software inventory, and system inventory. So that when you create, a, create these rules within LogMeIn, all the LogMeIn Pro 2 hosts that are currently running on the machines within your account with the applied alert package will be able to monitor and track progress. And if you need to go and drill into an individual uh, computer regarding its alerts, you can take action as necessary.